Right, so welcome back to the second part of uh, Kirsten talk. Thank you. Um, uh, so um, let's go back to, um, uh, we have these non-intersecting um, uh, lines. Uh, L1 through L4 in P3, and let's go back to counting. Um, back to counting L intersecting um, lines in, in P3. Um, uh, so um, uh, we uh, have, oops, what happened? Like that. Um, there, sorry. Okay. Um, uh, we've got uh, um, an equation for each line that is a section of the dual tautological bundle wedge itself over the Grossmannian. Um, this is sigma, and this actually breaks up sigma one, sigma two, sigma three, sigma four. Um, and we know that our lines um, that intersect are the zeros of the section. And we um, were just talking about our Euler number, which can be computed with our section with isolated zeros, which is the sum over these lines L in P3 intersection, intersecting the Li of this local degree. Um, and now we can do the same trick we did with the changing the sigma. So if we change the section to the section where we took minus sigma one, sigma two, sigma three, sigma four, then all of our Jacobians uh, change sign. So it multiplies EV um, by minus one. And while we're at it, we can multiply EV by A, um, which means we have that A EV is EV. And you can um, jack this up to a proof that EV has to be a multiple of the hyperbolic element, which had the special property that when you multiplied by A, uh, you didn't change the, the hyperbolic element. So is a multiple of H. Um, and uh, um, look, comparing the rank, comparing with the answer to over C, um, we get the E of V is equal to one, one H. So this is an integer multiple Um, uh, okay, so um, is there a geometric interpretation of the of uh, the local terms? So question um, is there a geometric interpretation um, of the right hand side. And uh, well, what kind of geometric information is available? We have intersection points. L intersect Li gives four points on L, which is a P1 over its field of definition. So um, they have a cross ratio. What lambda? of L be defined to be the cross ratio of L, Li in the same order that we do the, um, the section, section set. Um, and this is in um, K of L. Um, 
uh, we also have the planes um, spanned by L and Li. So let Pi um, be the plane um, spanned by L and Li. And um, planes in P3 containing L. And let's say L is the projectivization of, of a, a two dimensional vector space, W um, are um, three dimensional subspaces. Um, and so V, v um, which are in between W and um, K of V uh, um, to the fourth. Um, where so pi is the projectivization of say double uh, v. Um, so the space of such uh, the space of such um, planes is again a p one of um, the field of definition of of the point corresponding to w, which is also getting called called l. Um, uh, um, because they, uh, this is in correspondence with um, uh, uh, co-dimension one subspaces of the quotient of a four-dimensional space by um, a two-dimensional space. So we get a two-dimensional space here. So we get a one-dimensional space of planes um, containing L. So um, the PI then have a cross ratio as well. And thus P1, P2, P3, P4 um, have a, it's, it's four points on a P1 um, have a cross ratio. Four points P1, K of L. And let's let U, L um, be their cross ratio. And we have this cross ratio. Um, and uh, you can show that the local degree, the degree at L of sigma is the transfer of uh, lambda L minus mu L. And putting this together, um, we have um, uh, the result of Padma and me that um, given four lines, um, L1, L2, L3, L4, the four general lines in P3K, where K is a field of characteristic not two, Um, and then we get a count with some arithmetic information of the lines L meeting L1, L2, L3, L4 of the trace of this difference of cross ratios in brackets has to be the hyperbolic element in GW of K. Um, uh, we can, if you take um, co-dimension two planes in Pn, you can get a similar result. So let um, pi one, pi uh, two um, and minus two be co-dimension two planes in Pn for n odd, then there's a result that says the lines um, meeting pi i um, for all i of the trace or transfer of, so these are the lines L. Um, of a messier quantity 
the determinant of um, a 2n minus 2 by 2n minus 2 matrix um, uh, of dot products c i um, uh, b 1 i b i b 2 i and this is equal to 1 over 2n 2n minus 2 n minus 1 times the hyperbolic element. And these CI and BI um, uh, are uh, CI are um, certain coordinates for dinets for the plane spanned by PI and L um, and um, B1I. The two i are coordinates for L intersect P i um, inside this P one um, K of L, um, uh, and uh, as as a corollary um, over F Q, uh, you cannot have a line. Uh, defined over f q squared, meeting the four lines, um, with the cross ratio lambda minus u equal to a non-square, where q congruent to three mod four, and for a square um, with q congruent to one mod mod four, um, uh, and there's um, uh, um, related results giving some Schubert calculus um, for these folks due to Matthias Vent. Um, uh, um, well, so th this is the theorem that I'm really going to have time to say, um, but I want to call attention to the fact that um, these ones and minus ones are appearing because of the Z. Um, so uh, we mentioned that the growth and Vit group of Z is actually isomorphic by pullback to that of R. And um, one can show using some new results on Hermitian K theory by actually nine authors in a, uh, um, a, a series that was um, put on archive um, about Hermitian K theory without um, uh, inverting two. Um, uh, so, well, um, let X be a smooth and proper over Z adjoin one over D factorial for some D could be one. Um, and let V be a relatively oriented vector bundle. on X with um, the dimension the same as the um, rank so that our Euler number lives in the, the GW that, um, that um, uh, we were considering before. Um, so then the Euler number uh, is in D adjoin minus one, two, um, primes up to D or numbers up to D in GW of K. So in particular, we'll, for, for things to find over, over Z, the, the global counts have these minus ones and ones. There are some cool enumerative uh, setups where you get uh, uh, forms that absolutely cannot be expressed with the, the ones and minus ones, but I am out of time. So uh, I will stop here. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you very much.